What's going on? This is Legend Number All About The Kicks. Subscribe to that channel. Put a like on that button. Young Buck just can't stay out of trouble. You know 50 about to clown him now. He's fighting with Afro Man. Remember Afro Man had the hit song, Let Me Get High, back in 2000? One hit wonder. What you doing fighting with that dude? That dude was like 65 years old. What's wrong with you, Young Buck? B, sell your masters, pay off your debt, and get yourself together, man. For real. Like, I don't know you was out there touring, but you fighting with Afro man, come on, man. This dude's like 65 years old. You fighting with his his crew? Come on, man. Young Buck, you out here tripping, man. You need to get yourself together, man. I like Young Buck, man. Young Buck's talented as hell. He just don't know how to stay out of trouble. And he don't know how to just stay loyal. And that's why he in the situation he in. And I don't wish bad luck on nobody. Young Buck could go out there and get money. And he always want to blame 50. Oh, 50 not let me get money. 50's blocking me. There's other ways you can get money, man. Sit down and... Um, with 50 and be like look 50 I know I owe you two albums listen I know we don't agree eye to eye but listen man I'm gonna put I'm gonna put out some work if you agree you like the music then you know you you'll, you know you'll find it if you don't then it is what it is like but come on man get it together man get it together that's topic now young blue is laughing at Boosie because Empire is not paying Boosie his money I feel like Boosie contract is not complete Completely done, like Blue said, and he was on flat TV. You know what I'm saying? It was like a hand to hand type of stuff. Because uh, if Boosie's contract was good, he could stop Blue from putting out music. He could stop Blue from shooting videos. He could stop Blue doing for everything. I know he said he don't want to stop none of that. He want the money to keep flowing. But Blue is making millions and millions of dollars, and you're not getting none of that money. And you're in a lot of legal trouble right now with all these uh, gun charges and feds and all that. The lawyers is not going to be cheap. So you're going to be spending at least, for this case, at least two or three million dollars, maybe more than that. And you're going to need that money. I know when you was in jail, you missed a couple tour dates. So you lost maybe a couple hundred thousands on that. But Blue, he laughing at you. I don't know how the hell that situation got the way it is. Because you did promote him. You brought him on Flag TV for his first interview. Um, then your brother stole money from you, $400,000. He got Blue to leave you. And it's just crazy. And I just feel like this Boosie, if your contract is completely good, you should stop all that music coming out. Blue haven't really put nothing out lately, but I know he got some fire coming out soon. He is talented. And Empire ain't paying you nothing. So you need to get your job together. I know you were suing him. I don't know if that lawsuit's still going on, but you need to get that shit together. I mean, don't get me wrong, you did promote Blue. And I understand Blue feel like you haven't promoted him. He think he feel like he did all the work by himself. But that's how these, these, how these rappers and R&B singers are. When you get when they get put on, pretty people who put them on, they always shit on them. But Boosie, I know you won't do a lot of shit. You're one of my favorite artists. But man, that contract don't seem like it's good because like I said, if I had a contract with Blue, I'm stopping all his music. I'm stopping everything he doing. I'm making him not to do nothing. You're gonna give me my money. So if you wanna get off the label, you're gonna have to pay. Just like Future had to pay Rocco. He couldn't do nothing, but I'm paying Rocco. and paid Rocco $13 million. And that's why he came up with the double disc albums and all that. Paid Rocco, got Rocco out the, out the way, and he doing his own thing now. So you gotta be like that. Rocco took him to court. And maybe he did, he won that case, he had the paperwork, he was signed to the label, but uh, Future was doing some um, illegal business, doing some shiesty stuff behind his back, and they must have been best friends, and they, you know what I'm saying, they were, I don't know if that deal will ever work out again, the Future is talented as hell, but when the money come, people will always change. Let's go. R. Kelly cannot take a, he cannot get a break. He already, already got 30 years. Um, his victims is going to get all his royalty checks, mostly all of them. Um, the judge made that happen. Um, RCA got to pay the royalties to the victims. That's crazy. That is crazy. I don't know how much money do we got to pay. R. Kelly, they still streaming his music, so um, they, they ain't taking them all the platforms. They still got them there. Um, I don't know they got all the albums there, but this is crazy, man. This dude can't get a break, man. A lot of these females who say he did this and did that, they lying. But R. Kelly can't not get a break. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy, man. We gotta pray for him, man. I know a lot of y'all say, oh, that's what he get. It's crazy, man. I'm an R. Kelly fan, so I don't believe in that shit. And I know these women be lying. So it's crazy. That's time.